Alright, we're about four hours in here to uh, turning the frequency generator back on and uh, pulsing the Schumann resonance. And we got some pretty damn good results. I'll never try to not fight with the sky, because I like to keep everything clear and clean, but it's nice that this accidentally happens, so it gives me a chance to, uh, you know, do a test and show some evidence that this, uh, this has an effect on fake weather. Whether you believe our weather's manipulated or not, it doesn't change the fact that it is. We could argue chemtrail and contrail all day, but that's a useless discussion. At least in my mind. I, uh, I've seen too much with my own eyes and produced too many clearings with my own two hands. And it's just useless to try to argue with somebody that's not even to that point where they will take into account that our weather could be manipulated on a, a large scale globally. anybody out along the path, but realistically there's no use to talk. There we go. More CIA planes. Wondering what's going on. Out of the valley, even though I'm busted up here. As you can see, all the soup, plasma soup, is all hanging around out there. It's exciting. It's about four hours. Uh, you can also see where that device is pointing. I can assure you no healthy frequencies are coming out of that device. Hello, Ricky. As you can see, that trail that I was just shooting, it's, it was fading before I even came out here, but it's fading real quick now. And I'm left to. Alright, well, that's four hours. And like I said, like I can run these devices by themselves without pulsing the frequency. Won't do what the what it can do with the frequency. If you make powered devices, and I'm not even making them as powerful as I can. <laughs> There's so much advancements that can be made, but uh, I'm only one person with a minimal amount of money, and I'm still stuck in the rat race. So, but uh, at least you can see here. There's uh, as long as you can wrap your head around the fact that they're faking our weather and manipulating it for whatever extent or means they agenda that they have. But, um, if you can wrap your head around that, this should give you credence to, uh, you know, a lot of people are like, oh, you play with crystals and copper, they're weird. But, um, and a lot of people, they, like on my Facebook, thread, they can understand that there's geoengineering, but they still laugh and scoff at the fact that I took the initiative to try to find an avenue to do it, but they just think it's weird because it's crystals and it's not something that they're in tune with. 
which is funny but perplexing at the same time because <laughs> this needs to happen quicker all right Just, uh, if you build them keep building them if you don't research them if you don't understand what it's about research chemtrails start there